This is Missy Bauer, Associate Field Agronomist with Farm Journal. Today we're at one of the nematode plots for corn where we're going to pull some samples to have the soil analyzed as well as the roots analyzed at a lab for nematode pressure. So today we're at the strip trial that Stamp Farms put out where it was a split planter trial with half the planter treated with Vitivo seed treatment and the other half the planter was just treated with a normal insecticide on the seed. So what we're going to do here is pull a soil sample to check for, have screen for nematodes. We're going to use a regular soil probe to do that. When we probe, we're going to measure off around four to six inches from the base of the plant and then bring the probe in at about a 45 degree angle. So we're approximately four to six inches away, get our probe at a 45 degree angle and probe right down through that root zone. Pull it up, check my core. We're looking to, to pull about a, a six to eight inch uh, deep sample. We're going to go ahead and dump that in our bag. We're going to go ahead and we'd pull about ten of these in a relatively small area uh, within the plot uh, so that we don't get a lot of variation or variability. Of course, we'll pull several samples across the replications uh, to have analyzed as well. In addition to that, we'll also add in some root samples in here, in which case we'll actually uh, dig up a plant in the entire root mass here. We're going to get some of the bulk of the dirt or soil off. And then we're just going to snap the plant off right at the crown. Then we're going to go ahead and, and collect these into the bag as well. Now normally what we'll do as far as the soil probing, we'll pull about 10 cores and as far as the root samples, we'll collect about 5. We'll send these into the lab and again have them analyzed for the nematodes that are in the soil as well as in the roots.